Hey YouTube, it's Sean. Working on that there uh, generator that I promised uh, I was going to do. Kind of curious to see how it's going to work out. But, um, um, got the motor mounted on the frame. Let me back up here. I got the frame there. And, um, got the motor mounted on it. And, um, that took a little doing, but, um, just welded some bolts for studs. And, um, each bolt can be taken off. Or each nut could be taken off and the motor can lift off. I'm going to do the same thing with the generator part of it. <clears throat> but, um, this used to be a, uh, this frame used to, used to belong to a pump. Um, little, uh, pump, uh, like for a uh, trash pump. But, um, that's long since gone so anyway um i used i i, re, I reused the throttle control and i'm um, hooked up the cable and um if, i don't know if you guys can see when i move the controller here the um That hose is in the way for the uh, but uh, we actually have throttle movement there we go the best I could do I'm sorry about my camera but eventually I'll be rich enough to get another camera <laughs> there we go but um we got the throttle and um decided instead of a chain we're gonna go with a lovejoy connector and um swap the bearing out in the housing it's got a new bearing in it spins good and it's got a clutch in it so we can dis disengage the generator ha head <clears throat> or engage the generator head whenever we want so we don't have to have it running all the time unless you know you want it that way but by the throttle you can do that and, and um, by the throttle you can actually uh, adjust your voltage which I'm going to make a panel appear on this handle with a, uh, a meter to where I can read the voltage and I'm probably not going to put it in the middle because carrying it in the middle is pretty pretty good so I'm going to actually do it probably off to the side here you know make a little panel to where I can read my voltage output but um <coughs> here's here's episode one of the homemade mini generator and we're using for a motor a GX 31 little four-stroke generator uh, excuse me a generator four-stroke motor and um, it's totally stock nothing's been done to the motor um, generator that's different we'll get there but um there we go got the motor mounted got the throttle hooked up got the lovejoy connector on it and um she spins nice and that li i like that new bearing the other bearing that was in the housing was really really noisy so i took it all apart swapped the bearing out for a new one which i actually had in stock so had a bearing so there you go there's episode one and um, got the deck built for the generator head just use some uh, two inch flat panel or a flat plate and um, just 
tack welded it in for now and um just basically um just fabbing this up rough and then we'll go from there and solid it up and do some paint even the generator you know this is all just rough metal with grinding marks this is just the uh, fabbing it up and seeing how it goes and if it if it's worthy we'll finish it up and make it make it nice but I do want to be able to do want to be able to try it um, there's the throttle seems to work smooth and nice goes through the whole range of motion <clears throat> and of course the motor itself has the choke on it so there we go YouTube there's part one of the mini generator we'll see what we got take care guys bye oh yeah you might want to go down there and please thumb it up. Appreciate you watching, subscribing. Take care, guys.